Hello, this is Chaos Blue, and welcome to more Let's Play Golden Sun! Yay! We're back in here where I just came out of because I was staying in the inn. Um, and, although I didn't buy anything, incidentally. See, that's how much money I have. Which is entirely different walking around. Anyway, we are going this way because this is here. It's the barricade. This area is off limits to all who those without a permit. Okay then, Lord McCoy. The door is tightly locked. Can we No, we well we can move it, but Oh, I thought we could move that. I guess not. We can move this though. And that's what he meant by shortcuts. Doesn't matter if the door is locked when there's a big hole here! Ha ha ha, yeah. Okay, and... There's a tree that looks like a person. Looks like several, actually. They're so heavy. I feel for you, man. Uh, figuratively speaking, anyway. But, that is not our final destination. Our final destination is, hey, look, it's a forest. Actually, I don't think the forest is quite our final destination either. Well, it sort of is. Y y you'll see. Actually, maybe it is. I don't even remember. You know, let's just go to the forest. Let's find out. Um... What's the matter, Ivan? That sparkly stuff on the ground. What is it? Well, this looks bad. Ah! What's happening? My mind! Someone is attacking my mind! That's my shtick! And they all died. Uh, or not. What is that? Something's falling from the sky! It's sparkling! Could this be what turned those people into... We've got to get out of here! I can't! I can't move! Hubbada what now? We seem to have some kind of shield. Isaac, what just happened to us? That barrier, did it save us? Ah, uh, yes. I think so too, Isaac. Of course you do, you're the smart one. I think I know what those domes were. It was our synergy! Oh? What are you, crazy? I didn't use any synergy. No, it was definitely my synergy. Hey, I can stand! I can move again! Let's go break some roofs! <laughs> Ivan, it's okay. Go ahead, stand up! Well, now that you mention it... Hey, look! Those barriers! We thought that synergy was only used when we concentrated, right? Uh, no. You're such a li I'm not a liar, you're just an idiot. You might have thought that, but I always knew better. And that that's my story and I'm sticking to it. 
When I was training, I had focused so hard I thought my head would burst. Well, maybe it's just easier for you, but when I use Synergy... Anyway, I'm certain that was Synergy we were projecting. That must mean that some Synergy acts only when it's needed. You mean, like when we're in danger? Yes, that's exactly what he means, Garrett. I think it's like when we use strike critical hits in bat- I mangled that sentence. We can't control it, but it's there when we need it. Or when we don't. I can agree with what Garrett is saying. It is definitely possible. It's a sort of bad analogy, but anyway. Wouldn't it be something if we could use this power at any time, Isaac? Why, yes it would. Yeah, let's start trying to master it. Watch out, it's happening again. We are immune to your feeble attacks. Harum, why? Why don't they turn into trees? Who are they? What people are these? They who are immune to Trent's glamour. Have they come to save that village with their strange powers? I w it will not be enough to save the people of Kolima. They have earned their fate! Kolima took their axes to me! And now I shall take mine to them! You children may not know this, but we are dying. The Ancolima Forest will wither and die when we are gone. We are not the only ones who will die, Laurel! Once we are gone, they too will go! Trent was once a kindly forest king. But he's a tree. Well, you heard it here first, folks. Trench is the new X-Death. I'm calling it. <laughs> Oi. But he is slowly dying, and his heart has torn in two. His wrathful side turned the people of Kolima into trees. The kind Trent, there's a typo right there, hmm, speaks no more. Harum! The kindly heart invites destruction! I need no kindness! If you wish to save those who Trent, with an N, come on, really. Turned into trees. You must reawaken his gentle side. But you can if you cannot stop Trent from withering, we will all maybe it is Trent. I wait no, I could have sworn it was Trent with an N, but maybe it is just Trent. What you know, whatever. I don't care. It's Trent. Even if it isn't, it is now. Uh yeah. Look for Trent deep within the forest. It's no use, Laurel. Humans cannot be trusted. I shall die, and the rest of the forest will die with me.
Isaac, isn't there anything we can do? Of course there is, Ivan. What can we do? do you yes, I do. It looks like Isaac has something in mind. We'll leave it up to you, Isaac. Let's go save everyone. Okay, this is the forest, indeed. Uh, I don't actually want to be in here. I mean, I do, but not yet. Um, is it over here or over here? I don't know. I'll just have to track it down. Because before we go into the forest... Unless it, actually, unless the thing I want is through the forest, that's actually a possibility. Um, well, well, I'll check over here first, and I'll look a little bit of the ways to the east, but if it's not pretty close, no, it's not over here. But if it's not pretty close to the east, then it is through the forest after all. What the? Okay, uh... Sorry about that. I just got a stupid phone. I guess it serves me right for not putting it on vibrate when I'm recording, though. Oh well. Oh well, it's not a big deal. Okay, now I just need to look a little bit over here, and actually it is right here. Kolyama, the town with the tree people! If I could speak, I'd tell them this is Kolyama! Did I just say Kojima? Whatever. Village of Lumberjacks! Hence the tree stump houses, I suppose. Seems like a good time to raid their stuff for things. Seems like it. Maybe if I meditate harder, I'll turn back into a man! I don't think that's working for you. Just call it a hunch. It's the sacred tree's curse! Why did they try to cut down Tret? I guess it is Tret. If it was a typo, I think they would have fixed it by now. The water at my feet. Huh? Hey, it's delicious! If I can't move, then Mom can't make me go to bed! Ha ha ha! Okay, let's check indoors. How am I supposed to charge people for their rooms if I'm a tree? Who caused all this? Someone must have tried to cut down Tret. It was not your wisest decision to do so. Indeed. The villagers were right. I never should have tried to cut down that tree. <gasps> it's your fault. Well, luckily for us, we have an axe with us. Um... <laughs> No, we're not going to cut him down. Now I'll never see my family in Imil again. Aw, poor guy. I mean, he did sort of try to cut down a sacred tree, but... Hey, we found a lucky metal. Cool. If only I'd left town a day earlier, but this room was so comfy. <laughs> yeah. Oops. Not back up. Let's check the weapon shop next, I guess. Being unable to move is so inconvenient. It's too bad Isaac's a boy scout, otherwise we could take steal some of their weapons. I mean, come on, we're literally going to be saving their lives. It's the least they can do is arm us, you know? Man, I'm stuck inside. That means I can't even become a tall tree. I used to carve weapons out of wood. Now I am wood. Life's funny like that. Yeah, I, I, I guess. No, bookcase, but book, I can't. There we go. There's a book entitled The Holy Tree of Kolima Forest. Tret and Laurel are the spirits of the holy trees protecting Kolima Forest. Can't reach that. I dreamt that a mighty warrior with a thick beard ended this curse. I dreamed about him a lot, actually. Hmm. I think reality doesn't quite match that fantasy. What are they staring at? They seem awfully young. 
They don't stand a chance against Tret. Oh, ye of little faith. At least my father wasn't the one who tried to cut down the holy tree. The holy tree of Kolima has great powers, just like father said. Maybe we turned into trees because all the trees we've cut down! We were only doing our jobs, though. Oh hey, we found money! A book entitled The Art of Logging. One must study trees and train the one's body well before logging. Okay then. If you say so. Now, did I look at these? I don't think I did. Nope. Nope. Ah. Uh, no. Ah. Uh, wrong. Nope. Nope. Oh hey, we found an apple! That is yet another stat increasing item. This one is attack power! Okay, I'm not sure who we're gonna give that one to either. Like... Hmm, I'm really not sure what I'm going to do for the hard nut and the apple. This, I'd have a better idea with. I'm just not quite sure who. The trick of this is, it's not really worth giving it to Garrett because he is a lost cause. He is by far, he's probably the slowest character in the game. Probably. He, he's, he's down there. So it's not really worth increasing his speed because he'll never be fat, uh, re fast enough for it to matter. On the other hand, someone like Isaac, increasing their speed is more worthwhile because, well, he, he has enough agility that he can reasonably go before enemies. So if you increase his speed, he can go before more enemies. And hey, that looks like that's why we're here. Yep, it's a Ginny, because I was really here, only here for the Ginny, plus I wanted to mind read a bunch of trees. <laughs> I am old, I've lived a full life, I don't even mind being a tree. I just feel bad for all those kids who were turned into trees. Now I just need to remember how to get there. What will happen to my treasure if I'm stuck as a tree forever? I wonder what father's secret is. Dictionary for trees and flowers. The book describes every species of tree and flower in Angara. Soon, all of Kolima will be nothing but forest. Nope, nothing. Okay, um... Oh hey, we found an herb! This is a dream! This has to be a dream! It's not a dream. You wish it was. I mean, I don't blame you. I probably wouldn't in your place as well, but it's not. How could anyone turn a girl as beautiful as me into a tree? Actually, I'm pretty cute for a tree. Tee hee! Okay then. <laughs> if you say so. Nope. 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 No, I don't want to be stuck as a tree forever! Well, you should have thought about that before... Actually, you didn't do anything wrong, let's be honest. Now, I think... Yes, that was it. This is, prob this is probably one of the only hidden doors in the whole game. And typically, it's hiding a Ginny. Hmm, are there monsters down here, actually? No, I don't think so. Yeah, there aren't. Oh, oh, no, I spoke too soon. Well, whatever. Um, let's just kill us some monsters. Man, I've been synergy so low because he, he's been using mind read. I probably should not have used, uh, Ray. I should have used Flare Wall. Oh well, it's no big deal. It really isn't. More importantly, it's a Ginny! Yay! Earth Ginny number two. 
I think this is one of the really good ones, too, actually. Granite has joined Ivan. Well, first of all, get off of Ivan. Second of all... Uh... Oh, hey! Isaac's class has changed because he has two genies now. His earth level has reached seven. So, and at level seven, he increases... He changes class. Which is still a pure earth class. So he doesn't l learn anything new or anything. But that's why all of his stats are going up. Like, some of them significantly, even. Because each class has different, like, percentage ratios of the base stat that is sort of multiplied on. So, when you increase it, those ratios increase, and as a result, you have higher um, values for your attributes without any actual change to base stats. Or rather, in addition to the bonuses that you get from the Ginny. I, I hope that made sense, but Granite here, as it says, creates a mighty earthen barrier. What that means is if you cast Granite, then you are not immune to taking damage, but high... Your, it, hmm. How, how do I want to put this? Um, but you have high enough defense that... Any damage you take will probably be like single digit damage, is how much it'll increase your defense for one turn. I guess you could say? I don't know, I did I did a bad job of explaining that. But I think you get the idea. Uh how much money do I have actually? Um six, ten? Hmm, I might run back to Babylon, Babadil, whatever it was called, and buy the the Witch's Rod, because I'm not too far away from being able to afford it. Plus, also, I could probably use the extra um, in rest to just start fresh with Trent. Hmm, do I want to do that? <laughs> yeah, you know what? I think I will, actually. Because it'll be highly worthwhile to do that. I mean, it would be even better if we had better defense of items, but, you know, I'm not made of money. Now then. Now then, now then, now then. Right, you know what? Screw you guys. Just... Die. Overkill time! Hmm. Oh, you know what I just realized? Human enemies, like those bandits we fought... It's, this is like way late to be talking about this, but I, I just remembered it. So, I'm gonna explain it quickly as I finish off the episode. Human enemies, like those bandits we fought, that who cannot use synergy, so humans who are not adepts, are typically weak against all elements. That means that all synergy is very effective against them, but it also means that if you finish them off with any Ginny, hello Flint, then you get triple XP from them. Which I did not do, unfortunately. Which kind of sucks, because if I had, I would have gotten, you know, triple XP from the bosses, but what you gonna do? Anyway, <laughs> with that said, I'm gonna cut it off here. So until next time, this has been Let's Play Golden Sun with Chaos Blue, and have a nice day.